I'm Jim Eldon and I'm here at Morpeth Gathering but not from this way, I'm from Hull, East Yorkshire and my young friend Mossy, who's also playing with me, he's from Lincolnshire and our little dancing doll, Donald, we don't know where he's from, he just turns up everywhere we get to. Now this isn't your first time at the Morpeth Gathering, is no, it? No, no, this is my second visit to the Morpeth Gathering and my wife Lynette, she's been here lots of years because she comes judging the clock competitions here. And uh, what did you make of it last year? Oh, that requires me to have a memory that goes back an entire year. <laughs> and uh, as far as I recall, it was a bit like this. Yeah, was it something that you enjoyed? I hope so. I, I keep a little website thing and if I, if I checked up on that I'd find out, but I really can't remember a lot about it. <laughs> so what did we do last year, Moss? Uh, we did the parade. The oh yeah, the day. parade. I'll tell you what was ace about the parade. We are, as well as Donald, who you've just seen doing his little dancing thing, I also have another fiddle puppet, Gerald, who hangs from my arm. And for the first time ever, Gerald went on a parade with us and his little legs were parading away with the best of them. So we'll look forward to that for tomorrow for the parade. And do you travel all over the country doing this sort of thing? Uh, fairly widely. I think we've played together down at Sidmouth. That's a fair way away from here, isn't it? And so, and, yes. And, and what uh, inspires the, uh, the act, if I dare call it that? Well, the puppets, uh, uh, people's reactions, what inspires them. And, uh, and the music, we're both very keenly interested in English fiddle tunes and sort of carry a, a, a torch for English fiddle music when people turn around and wonder where the music's from. English fiddle music's what we play. And uh, the, the music and, and the pub, it, does that have some sort of traditional inspiration? Does it uh, is something that's... Yes, yeah? yes. The, the, so the tunes that I was just now playing for uh, Donald to dance to, uh, one of them comes through my wife's family and so that's a, a solidly East Yorkshire We don't have a name for it other than Great Uncle Sep's Real because it comes from Lynette's Great Uncle Sep. Um, a tune that we play that Mossy has from his neck of the woods is called the Wesley Jig. That's Again, that's that's from down... Where's that down your way? That's um, Epworth. From Epworth in Lincolnshire? Yes. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, and I can't remember what else did I just play. Sid's Twist which is a widely known tune that I also played when uh, when Donald was dancing and, and Sid's twist is from the Yorkshire Worlds, the way that I play it, yes. And what sort of reaction do you get from people when you uh, travel to various places? It varies between people walking past con completely intent on the shopping that they're doing and not seeing us at all, to people being quite engrossed and drawn into what's going on. And why do you do it? Uh, yeah. Well, do, uh, is it because the, you enjoy the, it? The quick, the quick answer that was in my head was, good, was going to be say because I get paid to, but and then I'm remembering that young Mossy <laughs> kindly comes along and has, gives his assistance free of charge. And I play lots of places for free as well, so it's made me a living until I'm now draw a pension, and so that side of it's less essential to me, and so we tend to work more freely than when it was making me a living. But clearly it is something that you do enjoy. Oh, yes, yes. And you get good reactions from people. Indeed, I've, got, I've just been playing this morning at a, an old folks' home, and the uh, sort of chief carer woman, Jonah, was looking after me. She was delighted to see just a tiny reaction from somebody from whom she wouldn't normally see any reaction, and so just a tiny reaction in that situation is a big reward for anyone. It must make it all worthwhile. It does. <laughs>